really the background for this story revolves around our involvement in the passive house movement. Uh, as a company, we began to construct passive houses and we did that early enough that we were exposed to the fact that you couldn't really buy a lot of passive house windows and doors in the United States that were plug and play for what we did. It was noticed uh, fairly, um, fairly early on that a lot of the building components, particularly the doors and windows, um, are, they are not available in North America from manufacturers in North America and therefore they need to be uh, manufactured and then shipped from uh, Europe. So we sort of put two things together and realized pretty quickly that, wait a minute, we can, we can build these things in-house. So myself, as well as Sam Hagerman, Skyler, um, other passive house consultants, worked together um, in designing and developing engineering uh, passive house doors. We had more options from Europe for windows. We didn't have any affordable or or real translatable options for doors. Um, a lot of European doors tend to be closer to doors you'd find on the Starship Enterprise than what we're accustomed to here in North America. We realized that while we'd still be buying windows from Europe, especially with the entry doors, uh, we could probably build those in our shop because we have a wood shop right here in Portland, Oregon. And this wood shop dates back to the beginning 20 year history of Hammer in Hand where we really placed a lot of emphasis on craft what we do today, but it is sort of revolves around the concept that we're woodworkers first and everything else sort of flows from that. The thing about our shop is because we are a custom shop, we're able to build a, a, a passive house door to the same uh, performance standards as the European doors and in many cases they exceed the standards of um, a lot of the European manufacturers, but also we can incorporate materials that are um, in keeping with the aesthetic of one's home. We also are able to provide all the other exterior doors to make them of a piece, so rear entry doors, side entry doors, balcony doors, double doors. Uh, we, can all, we can build all these doors in a high performance configuration that are both thermally resistant and airtight. We can do thick door blanks that have an R value that's quite high in the center and um, meet or beat anything that's available on the market, build it in North America, here in the United States, here in Portland, Oregon and build it with FSC materials and um, other hardware materials that are based here in the United States in most cases. So we can create a high performance product pretty much from materials that we have available to us in the open market here in the States. That's a great narrative to support um, local craftsmanship, uh, local manufacturing, and local supply.